Hello guys, welcome back to another video of Seriously True and today we are going to know what is heavy water. Yes, you heard it right, we are talking about heavy water. Let's get started. We know that ordinary water is a compound of hydrogen and oxygen. It has two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen and is represented by the chemical formula H and O. Heavy water is a compound of deuterium that is an isotope of hydrogen and oxygen and is represented by by the chemical formula D, O. In fact, hydrogen has three isotopes, protium that is ordinary hydrogen, deuterium that is heavy hydrogen and tritium. Protium nucleus contains only one proton, while deuterium nucleus contains one proton and one neutron, and the tritium nucleus contains one proton and two neutrons. Naturally occurring hydrogen contains 99.985% of protium, about 0.15% of deuterium and about one part in 1100 tritium. tritium is radioactive in nature. Friends, when deuterium combines with oxygen, it gives heavy water or deuterium oxide. Ordinary water, as obtained from most natural sources, contains about one part of heavy water for every 6760 parts of H and O. Ordinary water has a molecular weight of about 18, while heavy water has a molecular weight of 20. Density, freezing point and boiling point of heavy water are higher than those of ordinary water. Heavy water was discovered by Harold Clayton Urey, an American chemist in 1931. He was awarded the Nobel Prize in 1934 for this discovery. In 1933, Lewis and Donald were able to prepare a few millimeters of pure heavy water by long continued electrolysis of water. Look at the image shown in the video. Heavy water is prepared by electrolysis of water. If water is electrolyzed, the gas produced at cathode is mostly hydrogen and thus the residual water is enriched in deuterium oxide. Continued electrolysis of hundreds of liters of water yields pure heavy water. The operation of electrolysis is carried out on industrial scale. Baba Atomic Research Center, that is BARC, situated in Trombe, has a big plan for the production of heavy water. It has also produced at Vadodara, Kota, Talche, Hazira Manuguru, Thal and Tutikorin. Heavy water is used as moderator for slowing down the fast neutrons in nuclear reactors. In laboratories, it is used as an isotopic tracer in the studies of chemical and biological processes. It is also used in the preparation of deuterium and its other compounds. It is also used as the coolant in nuclear reactors. So guys, now you know what heavy water is. I hope you like the video video if so click on the like button do share the video with your family friends and loved ones do not forget to subscribe the channel stay tuned we'll be right back with a new amazing interesting video thank you and have a good day and keep watching seriously true